Good morning children. I am Sarada Isis from Sri Gogulam School, Vadagara. Now I am going to teach you double circulation in human heart. In the last class I taught you about blood circulation. Now I will show you the video of blood circulation. The heart is situated between two lungs. By the expansion of a right atrium, the deoxygenated blood enter into the chamber through vena cava. From the right atrium, the blood through the tricuspid valve enter into the right ventricle. By the contraction of right ventricle, the deoxygenated blood goes to the lungs through pulmonary artery for oxygenation. After oxygenation, the oxygenated blood through the pulmonary vein enter into the left atrium. And by the contraction of left atrium, the oxygenated blood enter into the left ventricle through bicuspid valve. By the contraction of left ventricle, the oxygenated blood goes to all parts of the body through iota. Now we can see double circulation in human heart. In case of human heart, the blood circulates or travels through the heart twice in one complete cycle. So it is known as double circulation. The double circulation involves two steps. The first step is systemic circulation. Systemic circulation. And the second circulation is pulmonary circulation. Pulmonary circulation. Here, in systemic circulation, the blood flows to and from the body. But in pulmonary circulation, the blood flows to and from the lungs. Now we can see the systemic circulation in detail. In systemic circulation, there is a circulation of blood from the body to the heart and from the heart back to the body. Here, the blood from the body through the vena cava enter into the heart. Which chamber receives blood from the vena cava? A right atrium. A right atrium. Okay, which type of blood? Whether it is oxygenated or deoxygenated? Deoxygenated. Deoxygenated blood. And from the heart, there is a backflow of blood to the body. Which type of blood? That is oxygenated blood. Oxygenated blood through which blood vessel? Iota. Through iota. Is it clear? So, which are the blood vessels involved in uh, systemic circulation? Vena cava and iota. These are the main blood vessels. This is the main vein and this is the main artery. Okay. And which part of the heart pumps blood to the body through iota? Left ventricle. So, which are the chambers of heart involved in systemic circulation? The right atrium and left ventricle. These are the two chambers involved in systemic circulation. Which are the two blood vessels involved in systemic circulation? The main vein, vena cava and the main artery, iota. Which are the two chambers of heart involved in systemic circulation? The right atrium and the left ventricle. Is it clear about systemic circulation? Now we can see the pulmonary circulation. The pulmonary circulation, which are the blood vessels and which are the chambers involved in this, we can see pulmonary circulation. In pulmonary circulation, as I told you, there is a flow of blood to and from the lungs. So first, the blood pumps from the heart into the lungs and from the lungs, back to the heart. 
So which type of blood enter from the heart to lungs? Deoxygenated blood for oxygenation. Through which blood vessel? Pulmonary artery. Through pulmonary artery. And from the lungs, there is a pumping of blood into the heart. And that blood is oxygenated blood. Through which blood vessel? Pulmonary vein. Pulmonary vein. Can you say which chamber of the heart pumps blood to the lungs? That is the right ventricle. And can you say which chamber of the heart receives oxygenated blood from the lungs? That is left atrium. So the right ventricle and left atrium are the two chambers of heart involved in pulmonary circulation. And which are the blood vessels involved in pulmonary circulation? Pulmonary artery and the pulmonary vein. So due to the presence of this pulmonary artery and pulmonary vein, the circulation is known as pulmonary circulation. Is it clear about pulmonary circulation? Now we can see the definition of systemic and pulmonary circulation. The uh, systemic circulation means the pathway of blood from the body to the heart and from the heart back to the body is called a systemic circulation. Pulmonary circulation means the flow of blood or the pathway of blood in the body from the heart to the lungs and from the lungs back to the heart. Is it clear? And now we can see the diagram. In this diagram you can see systemic and pulmonary circulation. So this area, this area is the systemic circulation. Here we can write this is systemic circulation because from the body to the heart and from the heart back to the body. Have you seen? From the body to the heart and from the heart back to the body. There is a pathway of blood and this is a systemic circulation. And can you identify the pulmonary circulation? This is the pulmonary circulation. That means from the heart to the lungs and from the lungs back to the heart. This is the pulmonary circulation. Is it clear? Now I will show you a flow chart of the circulation. For the flow chart, we can see from the body, the blood enters into the right atrium first. Am I right? Then from the right atrium, the blood enters into the right ventricle. From the right ventricle, the blood enters into the lungs. From the lungs, the blood comes into the left atrium. From the left atrium, the blood comes into the left ventricle. And from the left ventricle, the blood comes back to the body. Is it clear? So, this involves both pulmonary and systemic circulation. And we can see which type of blood is circulated or through which blood vessel. So, from the body to right atrium, which blood vessel carry blood? Vena cava. Vena cava. And from the right atrium to the right ventricle through tricuspid valve. Through tricuspid valve, the blood enter. Then from the right ventricle, which blood vessel? Pulmonary artery through the pulmonary artery the blood enter into the lungs from the lungs which blood vessel the pulmonary vein the pulmonary vein carry blood to the left atrium from the left atrium through the bicuspid valve or mitral valve blood enter into the left ventricle from the left ventricle through iota, through iota, 
blood enter into the body. These are the blood vessels. Now we can see which type of blood are here. So from the body which type of blood? Deoxygenated blood. Am I right? From the right atrium to right ventricle also deoxygenated blood. From the right ventricle to lungs also deoxygenated blood. And from lungs to pulmonary vein it is oxygenated blood. And from the left atrium to left ventricle also oxygenated blood. And from the left ventricle to body also oxygenated blood. Is it clear about the pathway of blood in the body? And now we can see here the blood pumps twice in one complete cycle. This is a cyclic flow of blood in the human heart. And this is known as, the cycle is known as cardiac cycle. So this is the cardiac cycle. So cardiac cycle involves two types of circulation. So it is known as double circulation. The two types of circulation are systemic circulation and pulmonary circulation. Now I will show you the video. You can see pulmonary and systemic circulations. The cardiovascular system is divided into systemic and pulmonary parts. The systemic circulation carries blood from the heart to tissues of the body and then returns it to the heart. Oxygenated blood is pumped from the left ventricle into the iota. The iota pumps blood to upper part of the body as well as lower parts of the body. In the systemic capillaries, oxygen is exchanged for carbon dioxide, resulting in oxygen poor blood or deoxygenated blood. The deoxygenated blood enters the right atrium through the superior and inferior vena cavae. The pulmonary circulation carries blood from the heart to the lungs for gas exchange and then returns it to the heart. Oxygenated or deoxygenated blood is pumped from the right ventricle into the pulmonary trunk. This results in the oxygen rich blood that flows through the four pulmonary veins and enters the left atrium. Okay, this is the double circulation of heart. Hope you understood everything about double circulation. That's all for today.